All right, let's talk about your pick for infielder, Steve, a guy who's gone deep four times in his past 10 games. Why are you going with Nolan Arenado? Look at that. Just taking some of the stats right off my sheet here. But Nolan Arenado is making his glorious return to Coors Field tonight. They should have statues in front of that stadium, not because he, you know, helped them win a World Series, because he was probably the last notable guy that they have in that offense at this point here. But Nolan Arenado has done one thing all season long. He has crushed right-handed pitching on the road. Now he goes to the best road park that you could possibly hit in, in Coors Field tonight. Against righties on the road, 339 wall, but 235 ice isolated power and six of his 16 home runs on the season. He's going up against Antonio Senzatella, who for whatever reason, like most Coors Field pitchers, they've pitched better at home than they have on the road this season. That is also, here's that word again, unsustainable. So I am banking on the Cardinals and specifically Nolan Arenado to maybe change the way that things have been going as of late. I think Arenado does well in his return to Coors Field tonight. I mean, Nick, can you make an argument against it? You know what? I thought I could, Jesse, but this is unprecedented, I would say. Steve actually won me over with his explanation of Nolan Nol Arenado. I'm actually going to give him this one. I will say that oh, we're, we're on the – well, you know what? I mean, I am doing better right now, so I feel like I'm in position to give you one once in a while. So I'm, yeah. I was thinking about Justin Turner because he's done well against Corbin throughout his career, but I think Arenado back at Coors Field tonight, you can't, you can't say no to that one. So good job, Steve. You won me over there.